At long last, the wait is over. A warm welcome to Wembley. This is Derek Ray, joined in the commentary box by Lee Dixon. And we're approaching kickoff time in what promises to be a spectacular FA Cup final. It's Burton Albion up against Tottenham Hotspur. Hi, Derek. Well, I'm biased because I'm English through and through. What a special place for a cup final this is. I absolutely love this place. And those players are in for a real treat. What a chance to put your name up in lights. Really looking forward to this, I really am. Well, you never quite know who's going to dominate a game in advance, but I think you can maybe make an argument for this fellow. Lee, what do you think we'll see from him? Well, he comes into this game with history, a hatful in his last game. We all know that, but also the defenders know that. How will they cope? So we can check on the lineup today. Pretty well balanced this formation, Lee. Yeah, it can be a 4 2 3 1 in the offensive mode, but it can also go back to a 4 5 1 when you're defending. The lone striker will be supported by the three just behind him, especially the number 10 who will be given a free roll. And Spurs will go with this starting 11. Hugo Lloris between the posts. Samuel Umtiti starts alongside Davinson Sanchez in central defence. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Harry Kane. And now they get the ball rolling. Good-looking sequence. And Spurs have the ball once more. Just the clearance that was needed. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And with the goalkeeper... Bale. No space for them here. And he's made headway. Kane! An attempt like that, never likely to trouble the keeper. No, he's got positioning right, but it was a poor shot in the end. Bad pass. Bale, goalkeeper's ball, and was always going to be. Take it away. Kane, crossing opportunity, not really the ideal clearance. There it is, how about that for starters? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild. As we can see here, it's great play. They force a mistake by pressing really high up the pitch. And when they win the ball back, just look where they are within striking distance of the goal. Great stuff. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. He's got to score! Oh, can you believe this? Just when it looked as though the door was locked, it's been reopened. Well, they're back in it and you can hear the relief with their fans. Game on. So, a level contest. 1-1. Sissoko and continues his run and in with a real chance and it's there for him and with that they take the lead well just look at the celebrations Derek the fans are starting to believe it's theirs well here's the replay it's a really lovely through ball and then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper brilliant strike well, behind they are, Tottenham Hotspur. How will they respond now?
Steven Bergwijn. Spurs get the advantage from the referee. Well, disappointing end to the move. Klojek. And he might be through here. That is goalkeeping of the highest order and of the bravest order as well. Well, it's not all about tipping balls over the bar and round the post. It's about being brave and diving at players' feet. Klojek. Opportunity. Tottenham really controlling possession. However, after that, the coach will be disappointed with what they've produced. They need to be a little bit more clinical in front of goal. Matt Doherty. Deli Alley. And progress made with the ball at his feet by Bale. Well, the referee making it clear on a different day, it could have been a booking. And that is when you need your goalkeeper. Dembele did well to win the ball back. Trailing as they are. What will be the thinking in the camp as you see it, Lee? Well, so far, I'd give this Tottenham side 6 out of 10. They've been the nearly team. It's close, a bit more aggressive in midfield and get the ball into wide areas a little bit more. Try and stretch the opposition. Matt Doherty. Well, couldn't bend his run and the flag went up. Dembele. The first half here comes to an end. So back underway with Tottenham looking to find an effective route back into this match. Went in strongly, decisively. They're racing away here. Very quick thinking there. And breaking at pace with Menace. He's in with a chance. Well, the post getting in the way there. But important for him to remain calm. So it's going to be a goal kick here. Adam Klojek. Deli Alley, Kane, and Hoybier with it. Kane, almost his second, and the referee has pointed to the spot. He's given the penalty, and now let's see if they can level it up. Penalty given, and yellow card. Can they cover up? Well, they can keep possession of it now. Attempting the through ball. Chance here. And caught by the keeper. Adam Klojek. And he's made headway. And there it is. A two-goal cushion now. And just look at these fans. The trophy coming their way. Surely. So there it is, 3-1 the current scoreline here. And reminder, tickets for the next game. Marcelo. Deli Alley now. Couldn't hang on to it. Deli Alley. A very good tackle. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Deli Alley. 
defensive Brazilians to shut them down let's get the latest on the injury situation from our pitch side man Jeff Shreves he landed really heavily on his shoulder there you can see the discomfort he's in but he's a tough guy I think he'll carry on cheers Jeff Spurs to make a personnel switch now Dembele Well, they know they need to stop him. Can they convert? The net is staring him in the face. And a goal to seal the hat-trick. A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Well, here's a second look, Derek. And it's not easy watching from a defender's point of view. They simply didn't deal with the danger. And they paid the price. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Just ten minutes to go. Kane. Lo Celso. Son. Smacks into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Klojek. And Spurs doing well to win it back. Son. And space for them here on the flank. Oh, he saved it well. Well, he's given a corner, the referee. Over it comes. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Kane. He's protecting it well. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter how much money you've got in the bank. Players will always look back at moments like these. These moments where you pick trophies up and win medals. Absolutely brilliant for this group of players. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware and that little medal that goes round your neck might seem small now, but you'll look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Yeah, it's been a long old road to get to this point. They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team. Now they get to join in the celebrations, go into the crowd and give them the cup. That's what I say. Well, then it might never find its way to the trophy cabinet, Lee. now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken well you know exactly where i'd be sitting in that photo don't you derek <laughs> i think i've heard it before lee <laughs> straight at the front 